Hello, come with me, Betty Church, tour guide, on a quick virtual walking tour of Newport, Rhode Island. The tour will highlight the years from 1639, when Newport was founded, to 1776, the beginning of the Revolutionary War. And you've heard fascinating stories since then. Let's go! This is the brick market that was a bustling commercial building in colonial days. Today, it houses the Museum of Newport History. We're looking at Eisenhower Park in Washington Square. The stately building with the upper balcony is the Colony House, once Rhode Island's State House. These unusual trees are Camperdown Elms. St. Paul's Methodist Church, built in 1806, is the world's oldest Methodist Church with a bell tower and steeple. The Jailhouse Inn is the original Newport Jail and later the former police station. This is Liberty Park and the future site of a marker that will memorialize the fact that Newport was a slave trading center in the 1700s. Built in 1673, the White Horse Tavern was first a home, considered the oldest in Newport, and later a tavern the oldest in the U.S. Colonial days, the Quaker or Friends Meeting House was a very busy house of worship. Today, it's owned by the Newport Historical Society. The Wanton Lyman Hazard House, built in 1697, was purchased and restored by the Newport Historical Society. This is the site of a future park that will highlight the first town well. Toro Synagogue is America's oldest Jewish house of worship. The nearby plaque commemorates the letter that President George Washington wrote to the Toro Synagogue congregation in 1790. The Newport Artillery Company is where America's oldest militia met. At the Vernon House during the Revolutionary War, General George Washington met with a French commander, General Rochambeau. Go. The Vanderbilt is an upscale hotel. Beautiful. The building was funded by a Vanderbilt and given to the city as the YMCA. Go ahead. We are in the Trinity Episcopal Church graveyard and seeing the marker for the French Admiral de Tournay, who led the French fleet to Newport during the Revolutionary War. Go. Trinity Church was built in 1726 by the British. The steeple is exquisite, isn't it? Notable attendees were George Washington and Queen Elizabeth. Now you have a window on Newport's history. Fun, wasn't it? Well, to hear more history and stories, take a tour with me, Betty Check, or purchase my Newport tourist map and take yourself around. For more information on tours and the map, take a look at this website.